Hi everyone, my name is Wesley. I'm the Managing Director here at Intamon Theater. Now today we're going to be getting a sneak peek at just one of the many technical skills that you can learn in our Associate of Arts degree here at Seattle Central College. Come on, we're going to go check out the costume shop. Hi, Rebecca. How's it going? Hi, Wesley. It's going great. <laughs> good. So good to see you. So tell me, what are we looking at today? So these are two of the um, main costumes for Irma Vep, and um, they are both um, designed with the idea that they have to be um, taken off and put on very, very quickly. Right, because the whole concept of the mystery of Irma Vep is that two actors play all the characters and they're constantly running off the stage and changing, yes. including changing gender. Yes, so the actor who wears these is actually um, a very full-bodied man. <laughs> yes. And so all of the, um, the padding had to be built into the garment um, so that they can take off the entire shell and become their male character and then put it on again and become the female Irma Vep character. So as you're building these costumes, you really have to think about the speed of changing and how are these built with that in mind? So what it looks like, it would be at least three pieces of garment, like a blouse and a jacket and a skirt is actually all built into one, including the under structure of the padding. Oh, I and see. And so here, it's designed so that here's a zipper, and it can be very easily oh, all the unzipped way down. all the way down, and the entire structure comes off, including the built-in padding. Oh, I see. And additionally, then, can be stepped into and zipped up very quickly to get them back on stage as the other character. I love it, and I believe we're about to take a look at a behind the scenes quick change of the actors in motion. So Rebecca, tell me a little bit about what the students in the Associate of Arts degree can expect as they're going through the program. Are they seeing costumes like this being built right here in this shop? Yes, the wonderful thing about these costumes in particular was they were built entirely from scratch. There's no way we would have found anything like this in already existence. So we um, had two expert cutters come in and um, measure the actor, build the whole padding understructure, measure the actor again with all of that padding on, and then build dresses to fit that new shape that the actor had. Um, there were all kinds of challenges as far as um, with this dress. Additionally, the pattern within it is a plaid and so the cutter had the extra challenge of matching the pattern throughout the uh, garment which is really beautiful to see that come together so nicely. Um, this one is made of velvet and is extremely heavy to put under a machine um, but they did a fabulous job. Our cutter did a wonderful job and additionally like all of these have hand sewn embellishments throughout the piece um, that the... It really is remarkable. It's so beautiful to see. And it's incredible when you think about, you know, we just have two actors on the stage, but when you look behind the scenes, just in the costume shop, there's so many union positions which are bringing the show to life. There really are. There was on this, on Irma Vep, we had both cutters on it. We had um, stitchers and we also had a craftsperson specializing in doing the crafts. So it's what you see when you're in the audience doesn't always tell you all of the people that work on making this fun production come alive for the audience. And let's do get a quick look at what the audience saw for the mystery of Irma Vep as these costumes debuted in a quick change right on the stage. She's just an ordinary woman and she doesn't need to go king at her. Now go back to your pigsty. A fan bit of company there. 
that ever I get it, Maggie Chris. Jane, did I hear you talking to someone? Yes, Nicodemus, he came to bring the eggs. Is he gone? Uh, yes, Lady Enid. <laughs> How's the sun set? It's pouring down rain, your ladyship. There's very little out there that could be called sudden. Draw the draperies and, and light a fire. I'm coming down. <laughs> uh, Lord, my work is never done. <laughs> Thank you, Jay. Okay, so we saw a behind the scenes look. We saw what the audience saw. We talked a lot about the different roles that bring these costumes to life. Tell me, Rebecca, for, the, for somebody considering joining this AA degree, what would you say to them as they're thinking about, is behind the scenes in the entertainment industry the right career for me? I think it's a wonderful choice for so many people. One of the things that is exciting about being behind the scenes is the family environment of a production team and everybody working together for a project that has a beginning and a challenging middle and then this rewarding end and you all go through it together. It's a really wonderful industry to be in. And you get to work with incredible people like Rebecca. Thanks so much for uh, giving us this look at the beautiful Irma Vap costumes. Thank you, Wesley.